YouTube. This is the September episode of Senioritis. Ta -da! I was going to do it weekly, but I, then I found out after the first week that that wasn't going to happen. So you get one monthly until I feel that more interesting things are going on. So, for September, and I guess this counts a little bit as August too. I don't know. Anyways, um, so started your senior year. That was cool. That happened. Um, but first week of school wasn't really that interesting. Um, second week of school, though, um, were auditions for our fall high school show, which is Snow Angel by David Lindsay Abair, who's the same person who did Rabbit Hole. So if any of you were at the Nebraska International Thespian Festival this summer, or if any of you are thespians, um, possibly you've heard of this show, or Rabbit Hole, anyways, you've heard of Rabbit Hole, it's the same, um, playwright. And this is one of his other shows, Snow Angel, which is very, very different. Um, my character, Jill, I'm still trying to flesh her out. Um, and we have to write, our director wants us writing journals, um, based, like, character developmental journals. And I went, you know, beyond that because I'm an overachiever. And Jill now has a blog on Tumblr. I will link that below and right here. And it is cupcakegirljill.tumblr.com. So, anyways, moving on. Um, and I got cast as that. Pause for a second. I think I'm starting to get typecast a little bit because, it, like, Jill, she's like one of the romantic... She's one of the... There's the two characters, Jill and Benny, and they are in a relationship, or they are at the end of the play, and, like, it's growing throughout the show. And so I'm, like, the romantic, one of the romantic characters thrown into the show. Well, I'm thinking I'm starting to get typecast because last year, I don't know how many people, I don't know, if, I don't know if I said anything about this, but I did, um, Arsenic and Old Place last year and I played Elaine, um, and romantic love interest, also romantic comedy type thing going on right there. Um, I've had more boyfriends, fiancés, and husbands in plays than I have had in real life. Of course, I'm only 16, 17, so if I had a fiancé or a husband right now, it'd be a little weird. Yeah. I had some bus issues, so I wasn't getting to school until like 8.15, and it was stupid, and I hate the bus, but I can't drive, so there's nothing I can do about it. But rehearsals started, and we were doing, like, character stuff, and it was fun. Like, we played, instead of Red Rover, we played Hence Ho, and we had to do Rebellions. It was fun. Yeah. And then we had, oh, fun project that I already had to do. Um, we had to read the 23rd um, Psalm. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I shall fear no evil, yada, 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 all that bullcrap. Well, we had to make our own. And mine's Doctor Who. I will do something about that somewhere. Maybe not. I don't know. We'll see. Um, this is the fourth week of school. And that means that the author, Gordon Corman, is coming to our school. And guess what I get to do, special friends? I get to go to his writing workshop. Yeah. I'm excited. So yeah, that's that's when the first month of school. Um, comment below about your first day, first week, first month. Are you having fun? Are you in sports? Are you in theater? Have you auditioned? Are you ready to audition? Also, if you live in Connecticut, what how how is it? What day did you finally start school? Because you know none of us started when we were supposed to, for the most part. Yeah, that stupid little hurricane. Um, Anyways, oh, one more thing, and, and, I went to a concert last weekend. That's how my first month of school's been going. It wrapped up with me going to see Mike Falzone and Megan Ton just at the space in Hamden. I got to dance on stage like an idiot because I'm white and I can't dance.
played Hence Ho!